Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Ben Affleck and Jennifer Lopez were pictured visiting his injured mother in hospital hours before their three day long wedding celebrations. The famous couple were seen outside at Savannah Hospital on Friday after an incident at her son's Georgia estate supposedly left Ben's mother needing medical attention. According to reports, Chris Ann Bolt fell off the dock and cut her leg at Riceborough property where Ben and Jennifer are holding a huge party this weekend to celebrate their recent nuptials in Las Vegas. She is said to have been rushed to hospital requiring stitches after the Batman actor called the emergency services upon finding her at his house. Photos obtained by DailyMail.com show the Gone Girl star and Love Don't Cost a Thing singer taking a breather outside the hospital and chatting to staff. A downcast Ben, who recently celebrated his 50th birthday, removed his face covering to puff on a cigarette while his new wife stayed by his side. He wore a vibrant tie-dye shirt and a pair of casual grey shorts. Upon arriving at the hospital, JLo, 53, carried a Christian Dior tote bag and wore a gingham pink summer dress. She was later seen offering her support to Ben's mother while she sat in a wheelchair. Mrs Bolt had a gore gauze on her leg after the treatment, but sources told Mail Online that thankfully the incident was not serious. The reassurance came after an ambulance was seen speeding into Ben's Riceborough property around noon, spending 20 minutes at the house before the Liberty County Medical Centre vehicle raced north. An insider said at times the ambulance reached more than 120 miles per hour as it flew down the highway under police escort. Mrs. Bolt's injuries came as the Goodwill Hunting and Hustlers stars prepared to welcome guests for their wedding bash this weekend. It's understood that the main ceremony will still go ahead on Saturday with a family barbecue scheduled for Sunday. As for Jennifer's mother's Guadalupe, she was seen arriving at the Savannah Hilton Head International Airport on Thursday while party preparations got underway, including the installation of a huge white marquee on the lawn. Ben brought the 8 million US dollars, which is 7.6 million British pounds, 86 acre estate in 2003 when he was engaged to Jennifer the first time around before splitting in January 2004 and rekindling their romance years later in May 2021. The loved up pair went in Sin City last month with Jennifer officially changing her surname to Affleck. Sharing the happy news with her fans she wrote in her online blog later, we did it, love is beautiful, love is kind and it turns out love is patient, 20 years patient exactly what we wanted last night we flew to vegas stood in line for a license with four other couples all making the same journey to the wedding capital of the world behind us two men held hands as they held each other in front of us a young couple who made the three-hour drive from victorville on their daughter's second birthday all of us wanting the same thing for the world to recognize us as partners and to declare our love to the world through the ancient and nearly universal symbol of marriage they were right when they all said all you need is love we are so grateful we have that in abundance, a new wonderful family of five amazing children and a life that we have never had more reason to look forward to. Stick around long enough and maybe you'll find the best moment of your life in a drive through Las Vegas at 12.30 in the morning in the Tunnel of Love drive through with your kids and the ones you'll spend forever with. Love is a great thing, maybe the best of things and worth waiting for. JLo signed off with her full and new marriage name, Jennifer Lynn Affleck confirming details of the marriage license and saw her indicate that she was taking her new husband's last name. Thanks for listening. For more celebrity news, please like, comment and subscribe.